It's the 21st National Conference of the Committee of Wives of Lagos State Officials. A thousand of them are present at the Eco Hotel and Suite, while about 6,000 others join virtually. Well, Mr. Governor, sir. The convention center is filled to capacity as the governor of the state, Babajide Songwolu, his deputy, Kadri Hamzat, the Udo State Governor, Rotimi Akiri Delu, as well as the First Lady of Lagos, Ogun. Ondo, Ikiti, Oshun, amongst other states, are present to witness this year's conference, focused on awakening the potentials of women and enlightening them on the need to be part of nation building. To have a new approach to doing things, to ensure that you have an integral and a sustainable mindset at everything that you find your hands to do. All of you working collaboratively as partners with government, we can achieve a lot together, working in unity. His counterpart in Ondo State calls for more active participation of women in politics. There is need, therefore, for women, especially our educated ones, most of us who are here educated, who are conscious, who are political, to start taking the issue of participating in politics very seriously. Don't leave politics to men alone. They have never led this country properly. A message from the First Lady of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Mrs. Aisha Buhari, is read by the Senior Special Advisor to the President on Administration and Women Affairs, Rukayat Green. That as women, our roles at home and in governance is important, and we must all use our motherly experiences to facilitate greater decision making. And the chairman of the occasion, Dr. Ibijo Kesonwolu, also asked women to contribute positively to the society. Dear women, it's time to assert ourselves and contribute positively to our society. Don't be laid back. No matter where you find yourselves, always remember that you have something to bring to the table. The event is concluded with a presentation of awards to inspirational women, while Super Falcons forward Asisat Oshola is named the Inspirational Youth.